So I free space. That no. <laughs> <laughs> what And now for our feature presentation. The Breeze, presented in THX, where available. We are the Breeze, where Ready Unknown Fox has some sponsors for us. Really? Yeah, go ahead. Come on, Jay, I'll let you use the sponsors. Well, it works. Go ahead, use the sponsors that you were talking about off camera. How do you use now uh, sponsor? to see it? Yeah. Because I'm not getting... I'll show you as soon as we're finished, Corey. How about that? Oh, you know how to use that plane to see it? Yeah, I think so. You were talking about, you know, Wheel Wheel of Fortune featuring Vanna White and Jeopardy featuring Alex Trebek? Oh, yeah, that's it. Wheel of Fortune featuring Vanna White and Jeopardy featuring Alex Trebek, both for the 16-bit Super Nintendo system and the Saga Genesis system. That's what Charlie O'Donnell said in the beginning. And we're doing a Wheel of Fortune Deluxe Edition board game showdown in which it's Ready Unknown Fox versus C3PO 626 and Ben S71287. Are y'all ready to go? Yeah, let's do it. Alright, a top dollar value for our first round is $750. We're playing for cash. And our first puzzle is Things. And Jay, you'd volunteer to go first, so here we go. Spin the wheel. Just did. You spun $300. First round category is things, by the way, in case I didn't mention. And you spun 300. Alright. Alright, I will start with the T. Next! Corey. Spin. 150. R. Yes, there is an R. And you have $150, Corey, so time to spin again. Time to spin again, Corey. You only have $150. Okay. Next! Bankrupt! Ooh. Sorry. Ben, your turn. Spin. Next! Lose a turn! Back over to Jay. Oh, that's strange. Spin! Next! Lose a turn! <laughs> Corey. Apparently it's contagious. It is. Go ahead, Corey. Spin. 250. No, wait, no, no, I'm sorry, 600. 600. And you want an S? Yes. There is an S, and you got some money back. I'll show you where the S is. There you go. Yeah. Welcome. In fact, uh, hang on a second, because I'm going to use my other ta uh, table tray to place the wheel and the portable keyboard I'm using. Hang on a sec here. Sorry for the technical delay, folks. Uh, Corey, are you ready to spin again, or do you want to buy a valve? What do you want to do? Uh, let me take a look here. Okay, the category is things. I'll buy those. Okay, there are two of them. Okay. I'll show you where the O's are at. Okay. 
and you have three hundred fifty dollars left. Say again. Okay. There we go. Four fifty. Um. D. Yes. I'll update your score first, and I'll show you where the D is. Again. Okay. 150. W. Next. Ben. Ben. 250. W. That's been called. That was been called. Um, L. There is an L, yeah. There you go. And it puts you on the board with $250. to J. Spin the wheel. Jerk the wheel. No, just kidding. Just kidding. Just kidding. Just kidding. <laughs> just wanted to do a 412 ham rock and press it there for you. Ouch. 150, J. 150. Um. Yeah. Next. Your turn, Corey. Oh, spin. All right. Top dollar value, 750. Make it count. Is there a C? Two of them. Nice. Uh-huh. That's $1,500 worth of Cs right there. Let me go ahead and show them to you. And tell me what you'd like to do now. You have um, $2,300. That is correct. And that's worth $2,300 to you, my friend. Now, that was only the first round, so, oh, my camera decides to fall over. Er, that sucks. Yeah, it doesn't want to, it's like a little kid. It doesn't want to stay still. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> uh, I swear, camera, am I going to have to get some glue on you or some duct tape to make you stay still? Anyways, there's the solution, vocal cords. After one round, Corey. Yes, he does. Jay, Ben, it's certainly anybody's game, so. Because for our second round, I'm going to put $1,000 on the wheel as a top dollar value. But i got to get an all new puzzle loaded up first. And as I mentioned, the speed up round and the bonus round will be puzzles that I will be coming up on my, with on my own. Let me go ahead and, oh, puzzle board is wanting to come off, but I'm not going to let it. There we go. Okay. Round two. Oops. Category for our next round is place, and we're going to start things off with Corey. Oh, wait, hang on before Corey starts. I need to load up the wheel a little bit. I've changed the wheel up a little bit because for now the top dollar value is a thousand dollars and I've added a five hundred dollar space to the wheel but mo but unfortunately I have to add another bankrupt which I hope nobody lands on. Category for our next round is place. I have the puzzle ready and Corey are you ready to spin it? You ready to spin, Corey? Yeah. Alright, here we go. 200. You spun 200. T. Mm-hmm, there's a T. 
Only one, though. Okay, there's... There it is. You only have $200, so it's time to spin again. Yeah. $250. Uh, N. Mm-hmm. I'm going to update your score to $700 first. And I will show you where the N is, my friend. There you go. L. A spin and then uh, call an L. Okay. You spun $600. I'm going to hold you to that L. And as for the L, next! Ooh. Ben. Ben. 500. There are two of them. If I can get that tile to come down, which I just did. There we go. And you have a thousand dollars. And all right. Next, bankrupt. Sorry, Jay, your turn. So with that spin. Which I just did, you spun five hundred dollars. S. Two of those. Let me make sure I put them in the right places. Yep. Yes, and you have a thousand dollars. Ben says BRB, okay. What do you wanna do, Jay? Thousand dollars, top dollar value. Make it count. All right. Is there a D? Next. Ooh. Corey. And my thousand dollar wedge just flew no my five hundred dollar wedge flew off the wheel, but you spun four hundred. Alright, let me see. Let's see. Next when Ben comes back, he'll take his turn. Uh why doesn't this puzzle border want to stay on? There we go. As mentioned, when Ben comes back, he'll take his turn. Saga. One word for you. Ow. All right, Jay. Have it your way. You spank me, I'll spank your thousand dollars. My thousand. <laughs> yep. In the corner when I'm looking out on the instructions here, the people at Merv Griffin Enterprises wrote these puzzles.
sorry about the wait, folks. We're just waiting for Bass71287 to come back so that way he can take his turn. Oh, he's back. All righty, here we go. 600. Uh, and, uh, M. Yes, there is an M. And you now, you have some money back, by the way, which is $600. Where are your manners, Corey? Where are your manners, Corey? Ben's mouth. Oh. All right, you have six hundred dollars, Ben. I could buy the E. The E, you said? Yeah. Five E's. Hello. Yep. So that will certainly help out. If I can get the E's on the puzzle board shown there. And I'll show you where the E's are at. You're down to uh, $450. It's still your turn. Oh, wait. Oh, I'm updating the wrong score. Hang on a second, folks. Ben has $350 and he wants to spin. Okay. Let's see. Oh. Okay, everything's right. Okay, sorry. Here we go. And one of the wedges goes flying off, but Ben spun $300. I would like to take a pee, please. Don't have a can or bottle for you, but I do have a pee for you. In other words, the golden toilet is this way. Yep, while Corey does it in his leader hosen. <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding. What do you want to do, Ben? Ben. 300 again. W. Mm-hmm. I don't believe it. You know how many there are? One. One. Yep, $950, Ben. You want to try to get some more? Yeah. All right, good luck. Oh, a bankrupt. Oh, no. No, sorry, Jay. You have $1,000. What do you want to do? You know what? Spin the wheel. 400. H. Yeah, two H's, another $800. Only vowels left. Can you solve it? Yep, Western Hemisphere. Correct. And so, I feel bad for you, Ben. I do, too. That's the way. But there's still uh, plenty of game left. Jay's in second place right now with $1,800. Corey's in the lead with $2,300. And well, you get to start things off this round, so anything can happen. That's right. We're going to play our third round in just a minute, which I'm going to put a $2,500 space out there. So it's certainly anybody's game. Yep. After two rounds, Corey, $2,300. And J, 1800. We'll be right back, folks. And we're back on. Okay, everyone. It's time now for our third round, in which I put a $2,500 space out there on the wheel. And I added a $900 space as well. And the category for this round is going to be Thing. And so far, Corey's in the lead with $2,300. J, second place, $1,800. Ben, you get to start things off. Are you ready? Hang on a second here. Let me make sure. Ben, are you there? Yo, Ben. Did he step away? Ben, you get to start round three. Ben. Oh, okay, sorry. There we go. 
$2,500 space up there. Let's see if he can land on it. Almost 200 Gee. Next. J. 450 R. One R. Mm-hmm. And I will show it to you right there. And give you $200, $450, rather. Twenty five hundred, Jay, you might want to make a count. S. There's one S and it's worth twenty five hundred dollars. I made a count. You sure did. And you have two thousand nine hundred and fifty dollars. I'd like to buy a vowel. Okay. E. There are three of them. Twenty-seven hundred left, Jay. Still your turn. I'd like to buy a vowel. Okay. Oh. There are two O's. All right, you're doing great, Jay. Let's see if we can keep it going. You have twenty-four fifty left. Spin the wheel. All right. Next, lose a turn. Leave the money there, it might get back to you. Corey, your turn. Gotta go. Where do you gotta go? To the bathroom? <laughs> Just kidding. 400. Uh, P. Don't have a can or bottle for you, but there is a P. Okay. And you have four. Oh, I know, it's been. Alright. 100. D. Mm-hmm. I think Corey might be on to something here. We'll find out. Alright. I'll give you a update your score to five hundred dollars. Which is right there, and here we go again. Six hundred. B. Yep. As in the Venus round. Ouch. Bonus round. But you have your belt, Jay. Didn't you remember that? <laughs> okay, you're, you're gonna spin again? Yes. Alright. Next! Lose a turn! Then you boy. Sorry. Ben, you wanna try again? Yes, Ben. Alright, good luck. 900. X. There is an X. Hey, you're on the board, $900. Wanna try to get some more? Yes, Ben. You got it. Alright. Ooh, all those wedges went flying off the wheel. But fortunately, you spun 250. L. Yeah, one L takes you to $1,150. You ready to solve it? Double exposure. That is no correct. Alright, double exposure is right. Let me go ahead and show it in the uh, chat box for proof. On the board, Ben. That's right. We played three rounds. We have three, win three winners. That's what we like to see. Yay. Uh-huh. After three rounds, Corey, you're still leading with 2,300. Jay, you're still in second place with 1,800. Ben, you're on the board with 1,150. So it's certainly... I put the comma in the wrong place. Certainly anybody's game. Because guess what? I'm going to add a $5,000 space to the wheel. Uh, I'd like to see y'all land on it a few times, but first let me show the puzzle there. Double exposure. Oh, cover that tile because it's not necessary. Let's get ready for our fourth round. Let's. Okay, flip the sheet over. Okay, this is a good one. There it is. And I'm going to load it here in the chat box. Category for our next round is a title. And we're going to start things off with J. The category is T. Spin the wheel. Don't make me get my belt. 400. Uh, well, let's start things off with a T. Next. Corey. Spin. 
2,500, Corey. Let's make it count. Okay. R. There is one R. You have $2,500. Spin again. All right. Corey. Nope. Oh, $2,500. And he's going to spin again. $2,500 again. Yes. One S. <laughs> and just like that, you have $5,000. And I'll show you where the S is before you make a decision. There you go. Now what? Oh, find E. There is one E. We're finding them one at a time, but you're finding them nonetheless. Forty-seven fifty left. Oh, find I. Okay. Takes you down to forty. That's not correct. Forty-five hundred dollars, and there is one I. Again, finding them one at a time. That's right. 4,500 left. I'll buy the O, please. And there is one O. Again, finding them one at a time. <laughs> Correct. Oh, wait. Typo. There. 42.50 now, Corey. The A, please. One A. Okay, you have four thousand dollars. What now? Uh, the U. Mm-hmm. One U, and looks like shops closed because valves are now gone. So you have to spin or solve. Closing in on 4,000. Spin again. Alright. 3950. Here we go. 250. Each. Yes. Oh, crap. <laughs> there we go. Uh, you're 4,200, Corey. What is it? Rhapsody in Blue. Correct. And this is a puzzle where if, no matter if it was a vowel or consonant, there were each one of that particular letter. Yep. It's kind of a rarity, but hey. And the solution was Rhapsody in Blue. And which now Corey has increased his lead. All right. How much did I say yet? $2,300, so he's at $6,500. Okay, and the J is yeah, at Y E R. That's not how you spell after. Oop. Yeah, it's kind of hard to multitask. But, oh well. Ben has $1,150. And as for the speed up puzzle, which we're about to play, I'm going to make it up on my own. So it's time for me to dismantle the puzzle board. Oh yeah. <laughs> Alright. Okay, and I'm going to move my laptop closer. I'm going to come up with a good speed up puzzle. There we go. I've got one. Category as well. Uh huh. Oops. Uh oh. What the crap did I just do? There. Nope. Ah. Pardon me, folks. I, I can't multitask. That's fine.
The category for this one is artist, song, and it's a pretty big puzzle. Oh boy. So now it's time for me to give the wheel a final spin. Then I'll ask you guys for a letter. If it's in the puzzle, I'll give you a chance to solve it. In this round, vowels are worth nothing, but how much each, will each consonant be worth? I'm going to put it over here, the wheel. $300 a piece is all I can do, but we have a lot of letters up there, so this could add up nicely. Remember, the category is artist and song. It's round five, so Corey, we'll start with you. Corey, you get to start round five. Okay, spin. Uh, it's speed up time. Each cost is worth $300 a piece. I will call a T. Uh-huh, there are several T's in the puzzle. So, let me show you. There are four T's, and you have $1,200. Can you solve it? Can you solve it, Corey? No. Ben. S. Mm-hmm. I have some S's for you as well. Yeah, and you have nine hundred dollars. Can you solve it? I'll pass. J. Uh, yeah, there's an R. You have three hundred dollars. Can you solve it? I cannot. Corey. R. Uh, ends. Uh, yes, there there are some ends. Tell you this right now, there are three of them. And that puts you at $2,100. Can you solve it? No. You cannot. Okay, Ben. L. Uh, yeah. $1,200. Can you solve it? I don't know it. J. Uh-huh, I have some H's for you as well. How many H's are there? One, two, there's three of them, so you have $1,200 as well. Uh, I can't solve it yet. Okay, Corey. Let's... I'm going to call an O. Uh-huh, I'll give you some O's. No money for them, but they could be uh, very helpful. Okay. Let me count up how many O's there are before I reveal them. There are six O's. No money for them, but they can help out. Do you know it? Pass right now. Okay, Ben. M. Um, yeah. Okay, and you have fifteen hundred dollars. Pass. J. Uh, w. Uh, is there a W? There is no W. Uh, Corey. A. Uh, yeah, there is an A. No money for it, but maybe it'll help.
Uh, a why. Yeah, there are some whys in the puzzle. Let's see, but just make sure. There are two whys, so that takes you up to 2100. Or, yeah, 2100, that's how much you have. Can you solve? Uh, pass. Okay, pass. J. Uh, B. Yeah, there are two of them. And you have 1,800. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, hang on. Made a typo in the chat box on the score. Now everything's correct. Did you have 1,800? Can you solve it? I cannot. Corey? Uh... Uh, E? Yeah, there are some E's. Once again, no money for them, but... It could help out. Okay. Let me count them up before I reveal. Alright. There are six E's in the puzzle. Can you solve it? Toby Keith does that a bloom. Bit of deciphering there for for a little bit there in my head. Yeah, but you came up with it nonetheless, and that makes you the overall winner of this game. In fact, uh, let me go ahead and show the puzzle there. Toby Keith does that blue moon ever shine on you? Which that round was worth twenty one hundred dollars, but I have a bonus thousand dollar question, which means you get an extra thousand dollars if you can answer the question that's related to the puzzle. Are you ready? Sure. Corey, for $1,000, what year did this song first come out? Two thousand nine. Uh, no, you had to go back to the 90s. It was 1996. Ah, 1996. Okay. 1996. But nonetheless, you are the overall winner. 2100 that round. That takes you to $8,600 for the game. And you're the overall winner. Going to play the bonus round here in a bit. But first, Jay, $1,800. We're glad you came up with that. And Ben, $1,150. I'm glad you came up with that as well. Yeah. Now, here's how the bonus round will work, Corey. I'm going to spin the wheel here. And whatever amount I land on, we will multiply that times 100. So if you land on the $5,000, you're going to play for half a million. Okay. I just have to come up with a good puzzle first. Okay, let me think of a good one here. Jay has a Koopa. Okay, I'm going to load in the category. And here we go. Spin the wheel one. One more time. You spent three hundred dollars, so we'll multiply that times a hundred. You're gonna play for thirty thousand dollars. Okay? And I can tell you that your category is gonna be a place, okay? Remember that. And if I can get this uh wheel dismantled here, I'm gonna show you some RST LNs and E's. Okay? Alright. That's all you're gonna get, Corey. You have to come up with three more concepts and a vowel. H, D, C, and O. Well, pretty interesting choices there. H, D, C, and O. Let's find out how many of those we have up there. I think, Corey, you've got this one, so you'd better get this. What is it? Hollywood. Of course. $30,000 altogether. $38,600. That's yours to keep, to add it to a run, or keep it as a Venus, whatever you want to do. Ouch. Oh no, ow, ow, 
you spank me and I'll grab that belt and I'll spank your Viagra 69 liter hose and derp. Ouch. But, oh yeah? But I'll tell you this, you spank me with that belt one more time and you'll pay my hospital bills with your $1,800. Oh well. <laughs> And I'll make the money where you have to pay taxes. Oh, well. Ouch. All right, fine. You're paying my hospital bills if I end up going to the hospital. What? Ouch. So, Corey, congratulations. You're the winner of the showdown with $38,600. And we'll see you all for my next video coming soon, assuming I can get my sore butt up from here. Always watch out for Michael Batten's erect penis. <laughs> I oh, hope that was... Young man, you're not supposed to say that on live television. So that was for Corey, thank God. <laughs> that got recorded? Yes, I'm still recording. <laughs> and I'm putting that down as a funny moment of the year for 2013. Alrighty, peoples. I'm going to let y'all watch the wheel here spin for a bit. We'll see y'all for our next video coming soon. And now comes the part where I tell everybody to cut to the Aubrey Scott Productions logo.